a new chapter in a hugely popular espionage franchise. Hi, I'm Nancy J with the Celebrity Spotlight on Jeremy Renner as our new hero in The Bourne Legacy. His life or death stakes have been triggered by the events of the first three films, and he's certainly up to the task. So let's talk a little bit more about the legacy, The Bourne Legacy. Mm -hmm. We don't. We didn't know that there were other people involved, do we? Right. I mean, that's kind of. I mean, what is the, the the key word, the key line? That I think there's never, the never just one. There's yeah. Never just one. Yes. Referring to a lot of things, really. There's never just one agent or assassin. Never one. Just never uh, one program like Treadstone, um, birthed born. Well, there's another program called Outcome that birthed a whole series of other agents outside of just even Aaron Cross. This, what they were they focus on in this particular movie and uh, then we just kind of pulled the curtain back a little bit more and realized there's a puppeteer behind all these programs mm -hmm. and um, it's kind of opened wide wide open at this point which uh, kind of makes it pretty exciting I think and I don't think it's it's important but maybe not necessary if someone hasn't seen the other four movies I mean yeah, this stands alone yeah the movie really is all the responsibility and pressure was for the fans to please the fans so I think ultra, ultra nerd fans, and not nerd in a bad way, but just people that are very, very like tuned in, dialed in, that, that love this franchise, like I love it, um, will be really happy. There's a lot of little Easter eggs and things that, that uh, they'll find in there to be, to be really satisfied, and a lot of answers to questions that they may have. And then there's a casual observer, which probably I'm a little bit more of that, <laughs> and just really enjoying this sort of cinema experience. I mean, but, Again, you don't have to see any of these three films prior and see this and still, it, 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 uh, it's an exciting ride and you get it. Absolutely. Yeah. And by the way, do you really fully get and understand any Bourne movie? I mean, it's, well, there's a confusion factor <laughs> in there and people can think they know the answers, but it's really meant to confuse you. Thank <laughs> so you, you should for be that. confused. Thank it's you okay. For that. <laughs> don't feel like you're not smart because you don't get it all. What's your name? Kenneth Kitson. Where are you from? Reno. Will you give yourself to this program? Yes, sir. Right hand, please. Oh, that has healed well. Any diminished sensation? No. There is nothing that you wouldn't do for this country. You have the strength to do what's necessary. Welcome to the program. Jason Bourne was the tip of the iceberg. Who the hell is he? He's an outcome agent. He's Treadstone without the inconsistency. We have never seen evaluations like this. things I really liked about Aaron Cross and you as an actor because we've seen you in so many dramatic roles and very serious or maybe the bad guy you actually have a great personality well I mean in real life and in the movie no I, I, I loved that right right well you know it's uh I don't know it's, it's in my interpretation, I guess, of things. Um, um, people are, are only limited to what they see and have experiences of, and I get that. And, but, you know, I started doing, you know, silly comedies and things like that in my career, and just sort of kind of the things took, took hold. And uh, I don't know, aren't we all complicated? Aren't we all have interesting things about us and what we reveal about ourselves? And Jeremy Renner is amazing. I can't wait for his next one. So look for The Bourne Legacy in your real-time theater. <laughs>